Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have an unboxing slash preview of Erin Condren launch items that are happening tomorrow, May 3rd for EC Insiders and May 4th for the general public of their new 2021-2022 life planners. You guys, I am so excited. As you guys know, I'm a big Erin Condren user. My budget planner is a Erin Condren planner. And if you are subscribed to my second channel, which is all about planning, you guys will see that I also have my life planner in my hands using it and I love them. They are the planners that I cannot let go of. I always keep coming back to them and um, they're just my life, you guys. So today I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the preview of what the flora in the vertical life planner will look like. Like that if you guys have any questions, any doubts, or if you guys are just curious of how the layout works or how it looks in this pattern, I'm here for you, I got you covered. And I also have a bunch of accessories that they sent on my way, of course, I want to thank the Erin Condren team over there, Tori, Sam, and anyone there who has considered us or me as an affiliate to help them with sharing all the love of planners that we have for the company. And oh my god, I'm so excited. Okay, if you guys are interested, like I said, mine is the flora design in the vertical layout, which is how I usually plan. They do have, I think three or four other layouts so it's the vertical the horizontal the hourly and the daily duo and they have i believe it's three sizes now they have the 7 by 9 the 8.5 by 11 and an a5 size now they all don't come on the same like layouts but there are tons of choices for everyone you can get them ring binder coiled it's all good. We got choices, we got choices, you guys, and that's the best part of it. So if you're interested, let's get right into it because we have a big old box that I'm excited to share. And I took a sneak peek, I ain't gonna lie, because I was too excited. I saw the box, I was like, I want this in my life. Give it to me. And you guys, I was like, this is gorgeous. From all the designs or the patterns, they have the mid-century circles, they have just my type, and then they have flora, which is the one I chose. Flora is to die for, especially if you like pastels and you like floral accents, but you also like it minimal in your layouts. Oh man, I can't, it is so gorgeous. So I'm gonna go ahead and flip you guys around so you guys can see the layout. And if you have any questions that I may not answer here on the video, go ahead and comment down below and I will get to you as soon as possible. Also, I just want to say I am an affiliate. So if you guys use my links, it totally supports my channel. It doesn't cost you anything extra, but it does help support hauls. It does support more content and it lets the team over there, Erin Condren, know that you know what? I have a love for them and you guys are part of my community and you guys are supporting me. So, so if you guys do use them, Thank you in advance so much, but now let's get started because there's so many details. Also, if you have never bought anything from Erin Condren, I do have a sign up link where you can become an EC Insider. So you can become, you know, first dibs at the launch tomorrow. And you can also get $10 off your first purchase that is sent a coupon to your email. So if you're interested in any of that, click the description down below, expand it, and you will get all the links to everything that I'm talking about. But let's show you the haul of everything that I got and oh my god I hope you guys love it as much as I do because it's gorgeous you guys everything is gorgeous like I'm a flora I'm a flora type girl okay I thought mid-century circles had my like like my heart and then flora came along and they were like no honey you we got everything you got nothing on us so oh, it's so gorgeous okay Enough of me rambling, let's get right into it. All right, here she is. This is the Vertical Life Planner in Flora in an 18 month layout. It comes in a gold coil and it does have my customization of Erica's Life Logs. You guys know this is my channel, but I also have a planning channel. So if you haven't subscribed to that channel, we'll link it up in the cards above. But look at this, you guys, this is so gorgeous. Now these start at $59. You can choose, I think, four covers there is the dahlia one which is the one i have but then we have the gardenia the magnolia and the peony and um they all start at 59 dollars however with every customization you add to your planner it, the price does go up changing the coil color does make the price go up um the amount of months that you want and so forth and so on so this is how mine came like always it does come with the erin condren 
ruler right here it is a frosted one this one's not clear so there is no clear coating that you need to remove this is just your basic one i usually don't really notice these <laughs> after i take them off or leave them on stuck there but um yeah you open it up you get this beautiful vellum right here and this one is like the sketches of all the flowers i believe that are highlighted in every month so even if you like finish this life planner you can really cut this and put this into like any other ring binder you can just cut them up into inserts it'll be good of course you have your title page which just tells you this is a life planner mine's is in the vertical layout it's always made in the usa so yay for us and then a look at this you guys oh i've never been a fan of the <laughs> of these pages before but this flora pattern is like it's so good it is so good and then the font is like this beautiful script font and i just cannot get over it this one says if you want something you've never had do something you've never done and honestly yes honey yes it's the only way now something that took me back for a minute was how minimal this planner was in certain areas so this is the year at a glance this is 2021 with 2022 on it this is in the academic layout so right here it starts at july and ends in december of next year but i was like oh my god where are my colors you guys like what but then i realized that hey we got washi that they um that they sell and these floral ones would look so good up here you can choose one to put on top or one in the bottom and i think that would look so great but i honestly love how like descriptive how minimal it is however i was shocked like there was like no color and i was like oh hello minimal self right here like it i've been in a kick for a minimal and then i go back to being decorative but you guys this is a good page especially if you guys just don't want any color whatsoever so then we move on to here and this kind of reminds me of the colors that were in the neutral version of the previous planner where you have these streaks of color in between um due to the layers design but this one they actually just made it more like even more minimal so on top it just has a goal is a dream with a deadline and honestly this is so cute and i can honestly just see myself putting um cindy's stickers right here since i've had them um before i can just recut them and they'll look perfect in here now this is always a page where i'm always like confused of like what am i gonna do with it and everything so what i've been doing lately is just been putting all my expenses that i've had for the month but that is in my monthly planner my life planner not so much i'm not really sure a lot of i know a lot of people put like home improvements and projects and all that stuff these are some of the pages that i really don't um tend to use much but anywho, once you flip over, you do get this blank page in case you need to jot something down in case you want to do like a year budget on here. If you want to do like a glance of something that's going on with your life before you start your planner. And then we will be beginning with the flora patterns. And honestly, you guys, I love these colors. These colors are so beautiful. They're like, they're color, but they're muted. So it's not like bam in your face, like colorful version of the Erin Condren of last year this is like subdued and honestly these flower sketches or drawings are so amazing and they always have the name of the flower down here along with what it might represent and then a cute coat at the bottom and then once you have your tab you do go straight into your planner so i'm happy that they stuck with the leaving the tab part with your monthly layout because i did not like when you would flip over and it'd be in the dashboard i'm really happy that it's back on over here with the monthly now the only problem that i have with this monthly layout is that it's so beautiful that i would hate to cover it up with stickers you guys like this font is so beautiful and then you get the pops of the highlighted month flower up here so for this month it's orchids so you got your orchids up there but everything is like clean it's such an aesthetic you guys this is an aesthetic eye pleasing planner and i'm so for it so you do get some um holidays on here some are like ones i celebrate independence day and then some that i don't recognize but you do have those there then we move on to your dashboard now a lot of people are fond of the dashboards i never know what to do with it so i always leave mine blank but you do get an extra line page over here so it looks like every time you have a new month you do get a blank page on the left side and then you can go ahead and start doing um your mapping of your dashboard here you do have the july over here and then your other 
um, orchid or flower that of the month there. I, I do want to point out that the design does go into the coil. So if you do put stickers down, you won't get that coil part covered up. But nonetheless, I think it's cute. And then if we go into the layout oh my god yes i'm so happy for this layout i have realized that i am a vertical girl i started with an hourly and then after they changed it back to um half hours i went back to a vertical and then i loved it however the only problem that i had is that i did not like that they removed the headers and you guys we have headers again so we have the top header but uh, middle headers and bottom headers and of course that space that we always use for washi I am so in love. I know a lot of people really didn't use header like designations, but I did because that's just the way I like to plan. But I'm so happy that I don't have to second guess where my headers are going to go. I can just like, there they go, like bam, 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 cut it loose. And I'm so excited. Now, there is no other design on here. It's literally like a blank canvas except for this pattern right here. So if you're like a full box user right here, you might have issues but there's always white out or if not you can always let it peak because honestly floral is so beautiful um they still do have the curved edges on there the font um is different than here so the month it is in cursive as well as down here at the month at a glance and i think this actually was moved down i think this was up here and they moved it down which i kind of like i didn't like it up here because i just i didn't know how to deal with it but this is how it looks and then right here you do get to keep um the holidays right at the top so there is no color change within the weeks you know how like when this is like this is august and then they would switch color because it turned into june that does not happen in the flora pattern it does not happen with the pattern over here so the floral stays designated as what it was so that is how the layout looks i really love it the washi space looks smaller but i think it's the exact same thing but yeah that is how the weeks look as you guys can see july is here and then we got orchids up in there so beautiful and then again we move into the next month and then you start a new page fresh and with a new flower and meaning and quote so what i'm going to go ahead and do now is just flip over to all the months that we have since all the layouts do look the same um the only difference is that the flowers up here in the month will change and everything else is going to stay the same um so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and flip through this give you a last glance of what the vertical layout looks like in the flora i love it it is plain it's beautiful and it has everything i want and i'm so excited and you can get this in a 12 month or 18 month um depending what you want i've decided that i wanted it in 18 months since i am tired of having my year split in two i want my life planner to be just one coil planner and i'd be good to go so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and flip through all of these and then i'll catch you at the end Okay, so now that we've made it to the end, there is the last week of December, the first day of January right here. And as you guys can see, it does flip into the notes pages. So you do actually have 11 notes pages on here. Um, if you count them back and forth, if not, there's five and a half because you, I count this one as half a page or one page in full if you're like me and I count back and forth. Um, so you do have five and a half or 11, how I like to do it. And it does come with a tap back here. So in case you like to set up some pages in the back just so you can have different layouts of what you'd like, you do have space for that. And then of course they have kept the contacts page back here. I never use this but I like having it. 
anyone else i never use this but i like having it and this one says let's keep in touch and it has your name and two bullet points and um all the bullet points um match the colors of the tabs which are pretty nice and then once you move to the back you do have the next year's layout since this planner ends in 2022 we do get the year at a glance of 2023 and then right here it just gives you bullet points so you can have some notes and then some extra line space in case you need extra planning if you do pre-plan for your next ones i'm not a a uh, big pre-planner but i've caught myself using these to look at some of the days ahead just so i can know like what might be happening or what days fall on some birthdays or if you want to look for future vacations you guys can look at this because that's how i usually find myself looking for so even though like i never physically write anything i'm always glancing back at this page which i thought was so helpful and so like minimal that you really don't notice how much i use it or how anyone uses but this is always coming in handy then of course right here we end with our advertisement page it says spread the power of infinite possibilities which is super sweet i do like their quotes and then it says all their stuff so you can shop at erin condren um if you are an ec insider or this will be your first time you can get ten dollars off a coupon that can be sent into your email I have links down below then we have these sticker sheets these are the usual sticker sheets that um come in the back of the planner so erin condren always offers um stickers at the back of the planner that you can use within your planner or in case you want to add something to like a letter or like me i usually hide my <laughs> mailing address when i'm filming hauls that's what i use these for because i like to use them up um these do come in the flora pattern and this one has gold foiling this one has rose gold foiling then we have some happy birthdays that have silver foiling so they do include um foils for every color that they have and then we do have like these appointment label boxes here and these are lined with silver foil then we come back here and then we do have this beautiful pocket it is semi foiled here at the bottom it is so gorgeous and up here you do have like the flora pattern it is this is like been my favorite pocket it, it, this is so beautiful like i really enjoy this pattern however i do miss that that zipper pouch but i have tons of those that i can clip in so i really don't mind it but I removed this um, to show you guys that in the back in this folder, you do get this calendar holiday extras. So in case you celebrate a holiday or an awareness day or heritage day, they do include some for um, most of the months here. And then down here, you do get extra flags that you guys can use. So in case you want to add more holidays um, to your planners, you do get that option in here. And I think it's just them being inclusive of everyone else. But yeah that is that and then in the back like always we always have the perpetual calendar you guys i can't tell you how many times i have never used this i i like that i get it if i don't get it i'll probably be mad <laughs> but i never end up using it i love having it literally i love getting it in my planner it's like a nice bonus but i can never determine what i use it for but it's always included and i love it and then of course we end with a dashboard where you can do white eraser kind of markers write something down or if you need sharpie then you can scribble it off with alcohol or a wipey and it'll come off but yeah that is my 2021-2022 life planner in the vertical flora pattern and uh i love it you guys it's so gorgeous it launches tomorrow may 3rd hopefully you guys are seeing this may 2nd for ec insider so if you're not an ec insider go ahead and sign up with my link down below if you're interested um if you have to be signed into your um erin condren account or insider account in order to have access to the ec launch which is like i said may 3rd but if you're just a general public and you just want to check out as a guest you can um shop the sale may 4th now if you are interested in helping me out and supporting me and my channel um go ahead and use my affiliate links they don't cost you anything extra but it does help me support my channel and my creativity my content and helps me keep bringing you guys content from erin condren so now that you guys have seen this i'm gonna go ahead and show you all the accessories and after that i'm gonna go ahead and let you guys know more of the other sizes that are available so let's get into it 
All right, as the first item that we have from the Erin Condren Accessories Collection is this beautiful pen case that includes a rollerball pen. Super cute. It is in rose gold and is protected by this plastic cover. And when you pop it out, you get this beautiful pen with the flora all around and it's a twist top so once you twist it the ballpoint pen comes out it is not gel but it is in black and it's super cute and you can have it like on your desk or as an accessory next we have the flora dual tape washi i love this this is super cute it comes in two colors it comes in the blue and the pink and I'm gonna pop it open so you guys can see. Um, they're not the paper type washi that Erin Condor used to have. These are actually like washi ones and you just pull them apart and you get to have the pink and the blue. And I'm gonna swatch them right now so you guys can see how they look on paper. So here is the blue one, super cute. It has flora designs all around. I think they have all the um, blooming flowers along with the pink one. And I think this one has more of like the lavenders and the same kind of floor pattern on there. So I'm gonna grab this Erin Condren notepad so you guys can see how the washi tape looks like against you know the Erin Condren whiteness of it. Now I'm not sure if it's the same color as the 80 pound mohawk paper that the Erin Condren planner uses but this is from their collection so at least you guys will be able to see um, the washi against like a stark white um, paper background. So okay, first one is the pink one and that's how that one looks and now i'm going to grab the blue one and show you guys how that one looks right underneath it so i'm just going to bring you in a little bit closer and i really love how this looks it's really cute so here is the blue one and oh, these are to die for like i'm going to put these on my um you're at a glance at the beginning of my planner because i'm just like i need the color there and yeah look beautiful look at those two stunning washies like you have lavenders and dahlias and orchids and um i don't know gardenias yeah that is the washi and um like i said they come in a dual pack so you can get both um in a set next we have the planty pack it is in a beautiful blue pastel with flora all around with an elastic band i'm going to remove it real quick from the packaging so you guys can see how it looks but the cardstock that it comes in is super pretty you guys it really is um but here it is it is this beautiful flora pattern i think you get all four of the blooming florals from the flora pattern and in the back there is a back pocket for you to add stuff so it does come with a rose gold zipper that you can just pull off and then inside you have like this machine washable like cloth paper like um, material so in case you know it gets dirty you could probably like scrub it off real quick and inside it has the Erin Condren logo but oh my god the flora is so pretty you guys I cannot oh, I love it I'm really happy about this planning pack next we have the bookmarks um, in the floral pattern they also come in the mid-century circle and I think in the my just my type so the bookmarks come in three colors blue flora vanilla flora and pink flora in a set and they're really nice each one i believe comes with the same certain floral background or two separate ones but the backgrounds are different and these are just ones um, bookmarks you can clip into your a planner so you can mark the pages of your weekly or monthly that you're on next we have the sticker book I love a good sticker book. I'm excited for this floral one. Um, I don't think I've seen previews of the sticker book yet, so I'm pretty excited to open this one up. As you guys can see, it has this beautiful foiling on the flowers and on the cover, and it's just, it's so pretty, you guys. I'm just gonna flip through it real quickly so you guys can see. Um, the front has rose gold, then we switch over to gold foil, and then silver foil this one is actually a neat one i think these are like circle ones with silver and then favorite part of mine is the washi that they provide i like using these when i mark like vacations on my planners they're really nice and then they have like these gorgeous script foiled words really nice and some of the petals as well 
and then more full boxes and quarter boxes and like some tiny headers in all the foil colors that Erin Condren offers on their site. And then you get some like half boxes and semicircles. But yeah, that is the sticker book in the flora pattern. And you can get that in mid-sized green circles, I believe, as well. Next, we have the posted dashboard. Here's how they look. They're these beautiful floral patterns with different um, colors and sizes with color backgrounds or whiteout backgrounds. And they're really nice to have. I usually just use these to jot down stuff in my desk, and I love it. Next, we have this to-do dashboard. I never used to-do dashboards, but it's nice that they comes with an accessory pack. And now we also have the checklist dashboard. I know a lot of people use these to mark down like their bills for their budgets. I just am not a fan of dashboards like that because I do like to plan everything on my planner, so I never tend to go for them. Next, we have a sticker pack. So these are the stickers that come at the back of your planners. Erin Condren does sell these individually in case you like the certain stickers from different layouts, uh, color options. These should be exactly the same that you find in the back of your planner. And since I chose the Flora planner, mine are exactly the same. So you do get the gold foil, the silver foil and the rose gold foil next we have the fine tip marker pack this is a whole new set from erin condren it comes in this beautiful um packaging that you can haul around and it comes with 24 colors these are in their um fine tip colors and look at that rainbow you guys so it is um felt tip fine tip and Oh my god, they're adorable. I'm not a, usually a fan of writing with markers, but these are super cute and they have so many colors, you guys. And like I said, there are 24 of them in here and I just love how conveniently they're packed. So yeah, this is the fine marker pack and it's in the colorful it's just gorgeous you guys okay now that you guys have seen the accessories and the light planners let's get into the, what is actually launching so erin condren has a ton of planner um covers that you guys can choose from you do get these daisy ones and like i said you get four of the flora patterns and then you get all these mid-century circle ones and then painted stripes which i believe belongs to them just my type so there are three options that you guys can choose from you can choose the flora you can choose the mid-century circles and you can choose my type or just my type and i believe those two other options come with a colorful and a neutral version and the flora is the pastel muted down um, version this only comes in one color choice so if we flip over like i said the light planners are at 59 dollars if you go with metallic covers they do start at 64 dollars and then they just go up from there now they do have a different choices so they do have the seven by nine and they have an 8.5 by 11 and they have also added a5 coil bound and then they have an a5 ring agenda and then i believe they still do have their normal binder system so you don't have to worry about that and they all come in different colors as well so these are just multiple choices that they have for each size and if you're wondering here is how the agenda ones look they're like pocket agenda um, binders it's super cute but you also get just your regular binder system here that you can choose in some of the muted down colors or mid-century circle which is one of the bigger um, designs that they have kicking off for this year they will have bundles in case you're interested so if you want a life planner bundle you can go ahead and get that in flora or mid-century circles and then something that i'm kind of really interested in getting are the variety packs of the interchangeable pens i'm a big fan of these they are my favorite and this is a new pack that they have which i'm totally excited for now something i do want to mention is that they also have a gift with purchase for may 3rd for ec insider so while slot applies last you will get like this glitter kind of pencil pouch i'm really excited i want it so i'm gonna be sure to get it and then also they do have this new flora um interchangeable tote strap and i have i think i have one or two 
um, totes in the small size and I already have the, the kaleidoscope in neutral and in colorful and I really want the floral one so that looks really nice. Of course everything comes in um, other patterns for like your bookmarks so you do get the just my type kind including the same other sticker books where you get the mid-century circle ones and also the planning packs and washi tape. I'm also excited about getting washi tape and then uh, more interchangeable covers that you can buy alone in case you don't want to get a planner you just want to buy the cover alone by itself and then of course new stickers they Aaron Condon does have stickers of their own and stationary postcards and then like Aaron Condon fashion you do get the folios where you can um, store your planners you do get pencil cases notepads um, sherpas or the floral one is calling me honestly and then some of the favorite ones that i've always enjoyed when i've been working are their lunch totes oh, i love their lunch totes they're so beautiful so when everything launches on monday may 3rd i will be getting an a5 daily coil planner i'm really excited about that i'm planning on getting a lot of the accessories for the mid-century circles and pens you guys i'm gonna be so in love so if you're interested in seeing a future haul don't forget to um, subscribe to my second channel i'll make sure i'll link that up in the card above or down below in the description box and oh my god thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye you guys